A second person is now charged. It's the latest in the murder of a William and Mary football player. Norfolk police find Nate found Nate Evans shot and killed near Old Dominion University one week ago today. 13 News Now anchor David Allen joins us from the newsroom with the new court documents in the case. Uh, the police just confirmed that the arrest of Jerry Spady Jr. stems from this murder investigation. The 22-year-old from Portsmouth is booked in the Norfolk City Jail being held without bond. According to the document, Spady faces charges for carrying a concealed weapon on March 21st. That same night, officers say 20-year-old Krishan Beeman shot and killed Nate Evans. The circumstances surrounding the murder still unclear tonight. Now tomorrow, a memorial service is planned in honor of Evans. It starts at 11 a.m. at the Live Church RVA that is in Richmond. Evans was the starting running back for the William & Mary football team, and before that, he played at Lee Davis High School in Mechanicsville. A GoFundMe page set up by the Tribe Football Parents Club is just about to hit $30,000 in donation. That's just after two days. The funds will go to the family for expenses as well as a social cause Evans was passionate about. Investigators haven't said how Spady is involved in this murder. We do know that he's due back in court for a preliminary hearing tomorrow. Live in the newsroom, David Allen, 13 News Now.